So, how do you use maths in your everyday life? Well, I do every day in a rather very boring way as regards to mathematics. Now, when I go for walks, I have this obsession that the walks have to be different each time. Now, what does it mean for them to be different? First of all, I, I imagine that I'm carrying a little piece of string or something, a very, very long piece of string, I should say, and that if I can deform one piece of string into the other, then those two walks are the same. So it doesn't, if I just you know, simply guide myself a different way, that doesn't count. But if I go around a tree in the, in the opposite direction, that makes the walks different because my piece of string, I couldn't get them across the tree. Of course, I could imagine throwing it over the top of the tree, but the tree is considered to be too big and it counts as though it goes out to infinity. So these are, are different walks. They're topologically different. And I also think that if I have a row of, say, 10 trees, then I can wind, wind around them in different ways, which means 2 to the 10th, which is already over a 1,000 different walks, you see. The trouble is I wouldn't remember which walks I'd already done. Also, if I retrace them by coming back, simply retracing the same walk, that counts as the null walk, because that's topologically the same. I can imagine pulling the piece of string, and it comes, comes back. It hasn't tangled around any tree. And then I worry about maybe I, there's a tree which is too small to count. And then a little year, year later, the tree has grown, you see. And so they become different walks. Whereas they may have not been different walks originally, but then they become different walks. It raises issues which are rather boring from the point of view of mathematics. But it's kind of vaguely entertaining to me in an irritating way when I go for a walk.